Hey guys, I just wanted to share a little product with you which I stumbled across, which is the Boss WL20. And they've also got the WL20L for acoustic guitars and the WL50, which is a pedal version of um, these. They're awesome. They just put them together to sync. And what they do is they pair up and uh, you plug one in into your guitar and then you plug one end in into your amplifier. And it creates a simple wireless system. And to charge them, put them together, plug it into a micro USB port and you're charging them. And you just leave them on charge until it turns green. I've been really impressed with these. Uh, I've been using it I've been using it a fair bit and I just love them. And it's so much easier than carrying cables around. Um, they've also got this thing called True Guitar Tone. So what you find is when you plug into a lead, the lead kills off some of the high end. But when you use these, they try to replicate it. Um, I couldn't tell when the lead was quite short. When it was a, like just using a three meter lead, I couldn't tell the difference. But when you get to about a, you know this versus a 10 meter lead, you can, you can tell there's, these are a little bit brighter than using a lead. On the floorboard version, the WL50, they've actually got a switch uh, so you can decide whether you're using a long cable or a short cable, which is, I think is really impressive. So you can obviously plug it in to the output of your pedal board. It depends on which way you want to be free. If you want to be free from the amplifier to the pedal board, then you can use this between the pedal board to the amplifier. But if you want to better run around on stage but still have your board on stage, then you'll need to run the lead from your pedal board to your amplifier and then you'll be free when you plug this into your guitar and then into your pedal board. I plug it in on the input, so it'll be on my volume pedal, but give it a go. The only thing I would recommend next time when your boss makes a redesign is that I want this thing to be able to bend so it doesn't stick out on your guitar so much. So there you go.